the cloud. Percy Bysshe Shelley I bring fresh showers for the thirsting flowers from the seas and the streams. I bear light shade for the leaves when laid in their noonday dreams. From my wings are shaken the dews that waken the sweet buds every one when rocked to rest on their mother's breast as she dances about the sun. I wield the flail of the lashing hail and whiten the green plains under, and then again I dissolve it in rain and laugh as I pass in thunder. I sift the snow on the mountains below, and their great pines groan aghast, and all the night tis my pillow white while I sleep in the arms of the blast. Sublime on the towers of my skyey bowers, lightning my pilot sits. In a cavern under is fettered the thunder, it struggles and howls at fits. Over earth and ocean, with gentle motion, this pilot is guiding me. Lured by the love of the genie that move in the depths of the purple sea. Over the rills and the crags and the hills, over the lakes and the plains. Wherever he dream, under mountain or stream, the spirit he loves remains. And I all the while bask in heaven's blue smile, whilst he is dissolving in rains. That orbed maiden with white fire laden, whom mortals call the moon, glides glimmering o'er my fleece-like floor by the midnight breezes strewn. And wherever the beat of her unseen feet, which only the angels hear, may have broken the woof of my tense thin roof, the stars peep behind her and peer. And I laugh to see them whirl and flee like a swarm of golden bees, when I widen the rent in my wind-built tent till the calm rivers, lakes and seas, like strips of the sky fallen through me on high, are each paved with the moon. And these. I am the daughter of earth and water and the nursling of the sky. I pass through the pores of the ocean and shores. I change, but I cannot die. For after the rain, when with never a stain the pavilion of heaven is bare, and the winds and sunbeams with their convex gleams build up the blue dome of air, I silently laugh at my own cenotaph, and out of the caverns of rain, like a child from the womb, like a ghost from the tomb, I arise and unbuild it again.